Hello guys, uh, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft Made uh, Simple We are playing this series and hopefully guys, you are enjoying it Or at least, if you can serve of any type of help well, that is a plus, and as you can see guys, you remember on the last episode, we managed to bring a bee nest And now we have a very active bee nest with some bees buzzing around, gathering pollen to create honey Look at that, it's full of honey, and this house is full of honey as well And as you can see, they are coming in and out, trying to do their job, very nice You will remember as well, on the last episode, we mentioned that we are going to create a bee house and that's going to be important so we can actually gain control of these bees that's going to be interesting enough so this is what is all about the episode and let me show you very very quickly the layout and the structure so it's going to be a 13 block long structure and we are going to start placing barrels as the base of this structure and we are going to place one two three four five and then on the six we are going to place a barrel and the same on this side and then towards the front it's going to be one two gap barrel a one gap for the door and we are going to do the same on this side and then this side is going to be exactly the same as the other side that is pretty much how it's going to work but before carry on let me show you the materials that we are going to need and by the way this is no exact a number of materials is going to be a super plus so whatever you see here is going to be more than enough to create you think you're going to have white stained glass paint and white stained glass if you don't know how to do the white stained glass it's very simple just get one white flower and make some dye and then mix it with the glass very very self-explanatory very straightforward so that's what we're going to need so i'm going to get some barrels in here some planks and some uh, oak logs and what we're going to do is start building up a bit so a uh, shift click of course one two and then we are going to place a barrel on the top there you go and we are going to do that all across all these uh, pillars which are going to be the pillars of course so one two and we are going to place the next one oh man and then i threw everything away as you should and we are going to do that all across the uh, this layout so uh, let's do that very quickly okay guys so this is how it's looking at the moment we are going to place one two and the third is going to be another barrel at the top in every single pillar on this structure so this is how it's looking for a minute so the next step is going to be joining absolutely every single column and we are going to do that very quickly and oops and shift click of course to do that in every barrel of course if i can actually get into that we are going to do that very quickly and very self-explanatory guys as you can see so it's going to be very very easy perhaps the most difficult part in here is going to be the roof the roof can be a bit tricky to do so we are going to have to be careful with this thing but uh, let's see how it goes and uh, now it's all finished or pretty much finished we can actually start working on the roof so that is going to be the next step but before doing that this is how it's looking guys okay guys so the next thing is going to be placing the stairs so we are going to put stairs right there as so and we are going to place this one next as well and this is important guys because we need to place one of these uh, stairs upside down so we are going to need the base to guide us to do that so uh, if you follow along just do what i'm doing and uh, i'm sure everything will be okay guys so now we are going to go at the back and we are going to place another step not in that uh, orientation of course it's going to be right at the top there and that is what we're looking for and then we are going to actually break this one so that is how it's looking at the moment guys okay so the next step is going to place a, a upside down stairs and uh, hopefully we can do that very quickly if i can even remember how to do it that is going to be the case and then we are going to destroy this one here the next thing we are going to destroy this one here and then we are going to have to go up there and see what we can do guys the difficult part on this one is that we are doing this in survival mode so we may have to switch to creative because it's going to be very difficult to go up and down but uh, to give you an idea on how to do it i think it's going to be interesting you know so so far this is what we have we need to have a upside down stairs just on the edge of this uh, barrel here on the on the corner and as you can see it's standing along there so that's what we're looking for 
All right, so here we are with plenty, plenty of uh, friends around as you can see. And by the way, I just switched to creative mode. So I don't think that these guys are going to attack me, but there you go, it is what it is. So let's do this very quickly. Now that we have uh, this completed, we need to place another steps right at the top. And that's not going to be the place to put them. And trying to figure out if we can actually do this perfectly, guys. So uh, bear with me a minute. There you go, there you have it. This is what we are looking for at this point. The next thing is going to be is we are going to place another stairs right here and that's going to be right at the top of that barrel. So that is how it's going to be looking so far. And I know this can be a bit complicated guys, but just follow along. Hopefully I'm explaining this properly to give you a hand doing this thing. And the next step of course is going to be placing now a, a upside down a stair so that is how it is looking at the moment guys so from here we are going to place another stairs right here and then we are going to place another one upside down as well uh, right there just like that guys next thing guys is going to be an slap in here we are going to place uh, another one there one on the top and one here and another one on the top so this is pretty much how it's looking at the moment Okay guys, so now we finished the frame of the roof in both ends. That is how it's looking at the moment guys. So next thing is going to be the center because we are going to have to do exactly the same on this uh, middle part of the roof. So next step is going to be placing a abs uh, upside down stairs. That's what I'm trying to do guys. Uh, so that's going to be it. We are going to place it that way. Oh man, oh man, it's getting uh, interesting to say the least. So that's how it's looking, guys. If you follow me step by step, this is how it's looking. Next thing is going to be placing another stairs right there as is shown in here. And then we are going to place upside down one right there. That is how it's looking, guys. Then we carry on to the typical roof uh, structure like uh, you do in any other roofs like we've done in the past in this um, channel, guys. So, so far, this is how it's looking. Next step is going to be the slaps as we already done. So it's going to be slap, 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 and another slap right there, guys. So that is guys looking so far. Maybe we can place one in there just to go in line with both ends. So that's how it's looking so far. Then we are going to have to do exactly the same on the other side. So we are going to place, uh, if I can do it, uh, there you go, up sound line stairs in there. And then we are going to place, uh, oops, that wasn't any stairs at all. Let's do this again, guys, but this is coming very complicated, you know, bear with me, guys, bear with me. So there you go. We have that one in there and it stairs in there. And then we are going to place the upside down right there. Then we are going to carry on doing the normal thing again. One, two in there as well as you can see. And it's looking pretty cool. That is how it's looking at the moment. So if you look at from this end as well, you can see actually the structure coming up. So uh, let me just take all these things. Uh, very quickly so you can have an idea how it's looking there you go that's how it's looking guys and of course the next thing of course is going to be the a slap so we're going to play slap 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 a slap and a slap and uh, that is pretty much how it's looking guys to complete the uh, frame of the roof so the next thing of course is going to carry on being placing with the stairs and we are going to do all the that around here the uh, frame so that's how we are going to place the stairs in a minute okay guys so let's put all these stairs all across the roof in here as you can see let's go back to the other side as well in here and we are going to do exactly the same in both sides that is the easy part of doing this build guys but uh, as you can see this is how it's looking at the moment okay guys so the next step is going to be a simple one we are going just to place some uh, locks and i'm going to use a uh, uh, oak in this occasion and we are going to place some stairs on the top we are going to do it just like that uh, simple as that so let's do that in every a column as well which is going to be very interesting to do it and when you get to the corners obviously you are going to have to put both of them so uh, there you go i'm going to leave the entrance there for a minute uh man oh man it's going to be very interested indeed this build i think and i think i'm going to love this one uh, let me check very quickly that we are doing this correctly uh, and again when we get back to the uh, corners we are going to place both of them as i'm showing you here 
but in a sense yeah it can be a very nice thing to do this little uh, build like this but there you go that is how it's looking at the moment so once you finish that guys it's time to create uh, put the planks up so uh, to do that we are going to place uh, planks we are going to have to take all this out and let's put plants right there only on the first row of each side guys don't don't go further than that and uh, let me just top up that very quickly in there and uh, yeah i mean very very simple uh, construction i think uh, the most difficult part probably is the roof but uh, it's not that difficult either and you know what it's really good to practice building you different types of roofs i personally like it very very simple uh, this one is going to be complicated for a minute but uh, it's different styles that you may be able to get used to it guys and and you know to the best thing to do is to practice so there you go this is what it is let me check this one very quickly in here and that is pretty much a uh, finish so this is how it's looking at the moment guys there you go so next step is going to place an upside down stairs on the entrance it's going to be the door of course it's going to be placed in here the door so i'm going to remove that very quickly and then what we're going to do then is just place the glass guys that's going to be very important so we are going to use paint in this case and we're going to place a uh, oops all um yeah all all into uh, these big windows because this is going to be big big windows so be patient with that guys take your time to do it and have fun doing it i think that that's the best advice i can give you but as you can see it's starting to get that very nice vibe of what is going to be a big house all translucent where you can actually see the beast buzzing around doing the job it's going to be pretty pretty cool i think so there you go uh, keep going guys because it's not going to take long until this is finished then of course we can look at decorating the outside as well which is going to be pretty cool probably is the best part i like when i do constructions it's going to be the outside so at least give you an idea and what to do with this type of uh, structure so let's finish that very quickly and then we are going to move to uh, finish the roof which is going to be glass as well by the way if you don't have paint so if you don't want to put paint you just can put normal glass that, that's not an issue either so don't feel that you have to do exactly as it is in here do it the way you want it that's the magic of minecraft as you can see it looks pretty pretty cool already okay guys so the next thing is going to be building the roof so we are going to play place all them just like so in here oopsies let me just get in there very quickly uh, so i can place it if i can do it oh my god there you go that is placed there very nicely let's go do the other side as well very quickly oh man oh man oh man um that is what we got so far so let's do the back again and it's going to be very simple i mean the, probably this is the easiest structure in terms of the roof uh, filling up the roof I would say the, the actual frame can be quite difficult but it is what it is and we are nearly done guys so that is how it's looking so far so that is the first part of filling in the structure of the roof so once you have accomplished that one it's time to go to the next level up so that's what we're going to do we're going to place one two three and four four on that that one goes in there as well and we are going to do the same in this side as you can see here very quickly and we are going to do the exactly the same on the other side guys so that is how we're doing this there you go one two three four and five is going to be the last one in there and then we are going to do exactly the same on the other side but as you can see how cool is it starting to look so once you have that one we are going to build it once more up again exactly the same thing that we just done and uh, that is how it's looking guys this i think it's pretty cool little build in this one is so uh, let's do that very quickly and of course guys don't forget to close the back at the front as well so very important that we do this as well so uh, very easy very simple i'm sure you can do that without much explanation so let's do that very quickly and uh, that will be then all the glass face of the walls finished completely looking absolutely gorgeous guys so as you can see everything is finished now it's time for decorations i think guys next thing guys is going to be the uh, spruce trapdoors uh, and we are going to use the door as well here so let's place the door very quickly and uh, that's going to be important that we do it actually because with our door guys we are not going anywhere so there you go it is what it is so let's place the door here very quickly 
and uh, maybe some of that will do the job as you can see okay guys so you can play some decorations around some lights if you want we can do that at the back as well if you wanted to just get some chain in there and i'm going to put two in this occasion in here because it's quite tall but you do whatever you feel that you can do of course so that's going to be the exterior obviously we need to get more to it but for the sake of this video to show you that's pretty much how it's looking you can place uh, more light on the side if you want as well uh, you can just put in whatever you want really it's just not an issue here so uh, just for the sake of of the video very quickly put these lights on the side and uh, hopefully that will make a bit of a difference to you obviously look for symmetry if you want as well so the same uh, lanterns are placed on the same uh, block of rows as you can see here and the same in here as well so make it looks a bit nicer that's all but uh, you know once once you finish the structure you can actually do whatever you want guys that is the magic of minecraft so in terms of the interior guys it's up to you i like to do a bit of a little path in here going in different ways or whatever you want to do really it just really doesn't matter but you know it is up to you how you do this and then maybe you can actually uh, bring a uh, moss is absolutely lovely i'm going to put some moss in here maybe some moss in there as well and uh, i'll see you in a second how that looks okay we have the most i'm going to place some most here there and everywhere really and i will show you in a second why i'm doing that so i'm going then to bring this path together here maybe something like that that is okay i mean you you can do whatever you want guys just just try a bit to to do your thing something else that you can do is just put some uh dirt cores in there as well just to give you a bit of a pattern i'm using some cursed dirt in here as well as you can see cursed dirt uh, just to give it a bit more of a, a look if you want uh, but uh, you know you can put whatever you want on the floor as well so very quickly let's get the uh, scaffolding in here that we are going to use and we are going to use the beehives as well so that is going to be the next thing that we are doing guys so uh, just place them randomly wherever you want you don't have to be specific to anything just you know just randomly here and there i'm going to place five maybe we can even put one at the back here who knows who knows just place them there and then we can actually place things at the the beehives we can actually place them at the top as well oops no that one there we can place that one that one in there and that one in there then what i would suggest guys is to take the bone mill and then a uh, bone mill the most if i can do it guys there you go and make it look a bit uh, more interesting actually some tall grass in here is going to come up into place i'm going to take all these little tiny trees because they are not very relevant really but you can see it looks a uh, very very nice and uh, you know you can place uh, grass or you can place flowers as well grass is going to be very very important that we place in here i'm going to place some flowers as well because it's going to be super important for uh, the bees obviously uh, for obvious reasons that's for sure so uh, you know place some grass around just make it uh, feel like you some flowers as well that we can put somewhere somewhere there uh, even bigger flowers we can use as well so I place these flowers somewhere there we can place them down at the back as well we are going to bring them right here because no matching here going on uh some pinks in here as well you know just just do whatever you feel that uh, you know is going to enhance the interior for you and definitely for the bees that is for sure but you can see this looking pretty pretty cool indeed guys this is how it's looking at the moment not too bad i think just for a, a little uh, bee house but uh, i think it's important guys that you know to to complete the game properly you know make every construction that you can that that's going to be interesting i think something else that you can do of course is to place some barrels if you want to you can place barrels uh, across these uh, walls in here you can actually place as many as you want or you know whatever you want to do guys but bottom line is that it's important to place some lights so you can place those maybe do it here as well uh, place uh, if i can actually do it maybe this way like that and then you can place uh, if i can do it i'm right on the block there you go maybe you can place some lights in there as well you know do do whatever you think is going to be uh, okay for you to do that is the main thing guys so uh, i'm going to place another barrel here last 
And there you have it guys, all these bees working hard pollinating all these uh, flowers to create uh, honey of course and that's pretty much guys how this bee house is done so uh, very interesting indeed as you can see uh, let's open and let's go in very quickly and don't disturb the bees of course and they are all working, doing uh, hard work in there and uh, yeah it's all very very good guys so uh, every bee is working and uh, this is how you make your bee house guys so there you go uh, please like comment and subscribe and i will see you on the next daily upload guys until then take great care